This video tutorial will guide you through the use of the marketing module in MyVision Express. Our robust marketing module allows for you to create numerous marketing codes that range from a simple discount on an order to the more complex two-for-one promotions. You will have the ability to create packages and define the items to be allowed in those packages. You can allow for these packages to be specific or you can make them eligible for upgrade. You can be as broad or specific as you want by using marketing groups. You can also create item level discounts that will only apply to the items you want in the order. Creating discounts for contact lens quantity is also easily handled by MyVision Express. You can later run reports to see which of your marketing campaigns have been the most successful. Let's begin by going to File, Setup, Marketing, Marketing. You'll see that I've already set up numerous marketing codes in the system. We'll begin with the package. The first field you want to consider is the location. This is very important if you have multiple locations. If you want this marketing code to only be applicable to a particular location, you would select that location from the drop-down. If you leave the location blank, this marketing code will be available in all locations. The code is the name that you will see in the drop-down. The source is where this marketing code is coming from. This is just an office promotion but it could be something that you sent out via the mail, newspaper, television, radio, etc. The description allows more room for you to type in the description of this marketing code. There are numerous different marketing types. You will see package, which is the one we'll be examining first. There's also a discount, a whole order, contact lens quantity, item level, and a two-for-one. It is important to note that you'll need to select valid date ranges for your marketing code. If this particular marketing code is a package and it's $199 for a complete pair, single vision, frame, and lens treatments. The package price is entered here. Notice there's a details tab. In here is where you'll configure what goes into this package. I have one frame at a maximum price of $99 one lens treatment at a maximum price of sixty dollars two spectacle lenses at a maximum price of sixty nine dollars each so the maximum discount for this marketing code will be ninety eight dollars notice the allow upgrade checkbox if you select this the maximum discount which would be ninety eight dollars in this case would be applied to the order and the patient would pay anything over we'll see that momentarily let's go to quick order and here's an order. Let's go ahead and apply our marketing code. Notice that although the maximum discount is $98, here it only discounts $59.99 because that will bring us to our $199 package. This has to do with the fact that the patient selected a frame that was less than the maximum price, a lens treatment that was less than the maximum price, and lenses that were less than the maximum price. So we end up with a $59.99 discount and still a $199 package price. Save this. And let's go to order $14.91. This order, as you can see, clearly does not meet the criteria for that $199 package as it stands. So we'll close this. And we'll now select Allow Upgrade. And we'll save. We'll go back to Quick Order and now let's apply the marketing code you'll notice that it discounts the maximum amount of the package ninety eight dollars and the patient balance is seven hundred and thirty one so again this allows you to use that package as a base and allow your customers to upgrade to anything they like by simply paying the difference we'll save and close next we'll look at the discount this promotion will take thirty percent off accessories and here in our details we have it as other, a quantity of one, and that's all we need to enter since we're doing accessories. Let's go ahead and do an order. Four accessories for Mr. Darwin. And here we'll say he's going for a case, 12 ounce spray, a cloth, and a silver chain. We can now come in here and do our 30% off accessories 
and here is our 1890 discount and we can save and close next let's take a look at a whole order discount go back into marketing and here we have a 20% off so this is now a whole order it is a percentage discount of 20% it can also be a whole order amount discount and you put in a certain amount for example $100 off a complete pair so let's look at this in an order and go ahead and apply our 20% off and there's your 20% off save and close the next thing we're going to look at is the item level discount the item level discount lets you select exactly what items to give a discount to and gives you some extra options in configuring the discount we'll go into the details button to look at this in this case I want to give a hundred dollars off any Marshawn frame so I've selected frame I've selected the manufacturer as Marshawn and here is the discount formula that I've entered before I get into explaining this formula let me tell you a little bit about these formulas that can be used when you're specifying you can use the special variable at retail which basically stands for the retail price of the item you can use arithmetic operator functions like addition subtraction multiplication by using the asterisk and division by using forward slash parentheses for grouping expressions the if function adds even more control by allowing you to specify logic let's say in this case we want to do a hundred dollars off Marshawn frames but there may be some Marshawn frames that are less than a hundred dollars and if we leave it as a simple expression it's going to take a hundred dollars off a frame even if its retail is less than a hundred dollars so in this case is where you want to use the if function the if function allows you to determine a logical test in this case if at retail is greater than a hundred and then you have to give it a value if true which is a hundred off and a value if false which would be just at retail so in the event that a frame is let's say sixty dollars then the retail price of that frame is sixty it will fail the logical test and it will apply the at retail discount which will give you a sixty dollar discount again let's take a look at this in an order let's first look at it in an order where you'll see it apply the maximum amount and here is a hundred dollars off that Marshawn frame which was two hundred and thirty nine dollars now let's look at it in an instance where the frame is less than a hundred dollars take this one out and go ahead and apply the hundred dollars off Marshawn frame notice in this case it applied the at retail discount seventy nine ninety nine since it did not pass the logical test of this amount being greater than one hundred so it applies the correct amount and that is your item level discount and all of the functionality of the arithmetic that can be used and the if function we'll save and close next we'll take a look at our contact lens quantity discount we've created a marketing code where we're going to give a certain discount off a one-year supply this is a contact lens quantity discount when we click on the details tab we'll notice that we have a minimum quantity of four boxes monthly lenses four boxes would equal a one-year supply I'm just selecting all contact lenses that are available for this you can go ahead and narrow it down by using groupings and you can also narrow it down by manufacturer and a specific lens type if you want to run a promotion on a very particular lens for now we'll leave this as is and we'll find an order and here we have four boxes of a monthly contact lens we can come in here and select our one year supply discount and you'll notice a twenty dollar discount is applied you may want to know where this comes from since we did not specify a dollar amount to discount in our marketing code we'll go to file inventory contact lenses notice that pure vision two six pack has a 12 month price with a quantity designated this is where it's tying in notice there's a five dollar savings per box 
since we did four boxes the discount was twenty dollars as you apply that marketing code to different types of monthly contact lenses it will apply the appropriate discount that you've specified here in your contact lens inventory cancel next let's take a look at marketing groups we'll go to file setup marketing marketing group notice I've created several groups already these groups can be applied to any of the marketing that you've seen previously you can also easily create a new one by clicking add determine what type of group it's going to be and you can make contact lens groups frame groups lens treatments others you can have a promotion on Crizal only lens treatments and create lens treatments for example Crizal discount group and then we can add items to it you'll save select my AR and let's say I want Crizal Elise easy Sun Shield and that's it you would click OK now you can go ahead and apply this group to a marketing code we'll click Save and close file set up marketing marketing here in the details let's say the lens treatment here rather than selecting the lens treatment item type you can click on the grouping notice this changes to group and then here are your available groups we won't save this next let's discuss the after sales checkbox in marketing we'll go to file setup marketing marketing notice this after sales checkbox is available by checking the after sales checkbox this marketing code will only be available on after sales orders you could link this after sales marketing code to a reason in your categories for after sales this is most commonly used for warranties with copay let's say you want to warranty a frame but you charge a twenty five dollar copay and I've set a few of these up here as you could see frame warranty with copay lens warranty with copay I've also set up 50% off lenses for a remake and you can apply these to the particular reasons that you'd like in categories for more information on after sales marketing code please visit us at support central and watch the after sales video our two for one marketing is very robust and is covered in a separate video this marketing type will allow you to create diverse BOGO promotions like buy one get one free or buy one get one fifty percent off etc if you are interested in setting up this type of promotion please visit us at support central and watch the multi-order marketing video this concludes our video tutorial thank you for watching please remember to visit us at support central where you can view additional videos